Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas, everybody. This is the Sliders Review. And I'm here today to talk to you in the month of December, since it is Christmas time and the holiday time, about South Park, a very crappy Christmas. So this is the return, once again, of Mr. Hanky. Now, something's been going on in South Park. Nobody is shopping for Christmas gifts no more. Consumerism just is like now dead. And because now people in South Park have learned the meaning of Christmas, being with family, you know, taking care of loved ones, being happy and joyful. So nobody wants to buy gifts. And of course, the boys are not happy with this, and especially Cartman. Well, um, Kyle is a little sad because Mr. Hanky has not visited him yet. And so he waits and waits and waits in the toilet, um, near the toilet, in the bathroom, just waiting for him to come, right? And it's so funny, he leaves cookies, and then when he comes back, his mom puts him to sleep. When he comes back, the cookie's been eaten, and it's by a cockroach. <laughs> and the cockroach's belly is like all big and stuff. So basically, he had enough, and he gets the rest of the boys, and they head down into the sewer um, in their pajamas to go look for Mr. Hanky. And there's a funny line with Cartman, it's all like, I hope I don't get sick walking around in his feces <laughs> and everything. Oh no, what happened? No, 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 what happens? He's no. Eric sneezes and Kyle's like, ew, dude, you like sneeze on me. He's all like, um, then he brings up the whole like, dude, we're walking around in like feces and you're worried about me sneezing on you. <laughs> so basically, Mr. Hanky is there. He just didn't come up to um, visit everybody. He's spending time with his family and we get to meet his family for the first time. He has three kids, um, a girl, a boy. The boy has glasses and supposed to be really smart and one who has a peanut in his head. So he's the dumb one of the group. And then we see his alcoholic wife who constantly flirts with people, drunk, is talking about the penis size and Mr. Hanky and everything. So Kyle tells him straight up, you know, what's been going on and nobody's in the Christmas spirits. And Cartman's all like, I barely got any um, Christmas gifts underneath the tree and everything. And so, you know, Mr. Hanky's gonna fix all that. So they all decided, uh, what if they have like um fixed the like uh, you know, something happens they want to like make a movie to get people in the Christmas spirit so um the kids um they go like, I think like to like the mayor and ask for like money for a budget and she thinks it's a stupid idea but she needs something to get people into the store so she gives them some money and and tell the boys you better not fail <laughs> and stuff. So they have to figure out how to make a movie. So they're gonna make like a little cartoon thing. And what's so interesting about the cartoon thing that they make is that they do it in construction paper that Butters constructs for them and stuff. And so like, it's the way Matt and Trey Parker, it's funny they call them Matt and Trey Parker. Cause I think um, Matt's name is something different. Matt Stone and Trey Parker. But they always call him Matt and Trey Parker for some reason. But anyway, that's how they used to make South Park back in the day. It was made back in like construction paper and stuff. That's how they did like the pilot for the Christmas special. And that's how it, um, and it, and it took forever to do it because it's basically stop motion. So you have to like take so many pictures per frame for like mouth movements and hand. stop motion takes forever. But a lot of people now do it on the computer and stuff. And which is what they do. It's a whole lot more faster. That's how they're able to bump things out a whole lot faster now. Speaking of which, why is there pandemic specials on Paramount Plus now all of a sudden? Shouldn't it be like on Comedy Central or something like that? Like, I don't understand what the world is going on. Like, what happened to their contract and stuff? So anyway, um, Butters makes like a figure himself and has like a doll and all like, um, he... Like, she's all like, you want to smack me around a little bit? <laughs> and he's all like, nah, I'll get in trouble. <laughs> I love Butters. Butters was awesome. Until they made him a main character as one of the boys in the group. And they, somehow they just ruined that for some reason. I think they ruined that on purpose. Because that's what people, like, people wanted Butters to be like, you know, the fifth kid. But then they had to make him the fourth kid. And then to not make that stick, they just ruined him. Then they brought in Tweak for some bizarre reason when they had killed Kenny off. So... They get like, you know, they finally like record their voices and everything, you know what I'm saying? And <laughs> it's so funny because Cartman sneezes and messes up what they're doing and like he leaves. And so Stan sings like, no, somebody think of it is. Is it Stan or Cal? They sing like a Christmas song and then one of their faces transforms into like a weird like holiday special character and stuff. And so they get everything ready and it's working and then they um, 
Mr. Hank and his family get the projector working and then boom, as soon as they start playing it, which by the way, they're playing the unaired pilot, the Christmas special. And then all of a sudden the projector messes up and everybody's all like, oh, well, Christmas sucks, it's dead. <laughs> and so the mayor is pissed and wants to sue. And so everybody's like really sad. And then Mr. Hanky realizes that Corn Wallace is really sad, his son, with the glasses. And he's all like, you know, he's upset because he keeps seeing all these Christmas specials, but he never sees any Christmas poo. And then so he doesn't understand why there's no Christmas poo and they're the only ones. And so Mr. Hanky sings him this really cool like Lion King type song about like uh, the circle of life type thing. And, um, at some point in time, you know, everybody like gets like still down in the dumps, right? And so like Cornwallis helps pick up Mr. Hanky's spirits. But then he helps pick up the boy spirit so they redo everything and then boom like you know it's working the projector's working the movie's playing and we get to see like the unaired pilot which i didn't even know existed until i found it on youtube one time and then so cartman comes on like thank you thank you thank you for all the good work i've done and they're all like what you left <laughs> and they're like I left what are you talking about i don't remember doing that <laughs> And so now everybody wants to head into the stores and buy presents and gifts and like all this other stuff. And it's a Christmas miracle and everything, you know? And this is back when South Park used to be so good, so funny. I don't know what the world happened to them. It's like they, they literally ran out of ideas. And not only did they run out of ideas, but okay, like halfway into South Park, in the early beginning, halfway into it, they started doing more like whatever the topic of the day was going on a week in the real world. And it still worked. It still was funny. But then something happened towards like the like 16th, 17th, 18th like season and stuff like that. They started getting boring and weird and, and, and nothing was ever funny no more. And like the whole Cartman, his girlfriend thing was kind of funny to see Cartman like, ugh. I can't stand her. Then they break up and then he's crying and everything. But then it's just kind of like something just happened with this show and it hadn't been funny for years until recently when they started putting out all these specials because they are unable to film the way they used to and stuff. And now it makes me wonder how long are they really going to stay on now? Because they were supposed to go on to like season like 30 or some crap. And now it's like it makes you wonder because of what's going on in the real world and stuff. Bah humbug, that was a good episode. All right, everybody, I'll talk to you later. Bye.